I came down here specifically for physical ailments that I had. Um, some of them greater than others, but nothing that I felt, I mean, something that I felt needed to be addressed uh, during my age. And so I came down here seeking, you know, a solution. And um, so that's why I came to Medellin. I didn't come here to honestly to travel. I didn't come here to check out Medellin. I had no intentions of that. It was specifically for medical reasons. And um, I've been pre pleasantly surprised. How did you know about BioAccelerator? Um, my friend Frank Meir is the one that uh, connected us with you. So I'm really, really glad. As a matter of fact, the other day walking down the hallway um, in the hotel room, I told him thank you very much for connecting us to BioAccelerator. It's, it's, it's had a huge impact. How have you felt? How has it been for you with the treatment especially? You know, it's interesting because sometimes you, you pay for a service and you don't know what you're going to get. Um, or you invest in, in, a, in a cure f to solve for an ailment or, or to hopefully solve for the ailment. And you don't know what your return on investment is going to be. At ROI, um, it has been amazing to me. I, I came here specifically for my back. I had suffered a car accident and had torn, two torn uh, discs. So it, 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 it hindered my ability if I sat too long um, as an executive for the company that I work uh, for. Um, I sit all day long. I sit a lot. And so my only activity is at the gym. And I really believe in physical therapy. I'm not a skeptic, but um, I believe, I, I, well, I like to refer to myself as a realist. Um, and I'm not cynical neither, but um, I take things for face value. And sometimes, and I, I can take it for face value, but sometimes I have to investigate a little further. Did I have some questions before coming to Medellin? Yes, I've never been to Medellin. Like everybody else, you hear the stories, right? But again, um, I've traveled enough across the world to understand that it's not always how people communicate it. And so I was really more interested, less in the city and what, what the concerns are in the city or in the country of Colombia, more about, I'm about to be put under, or possibly put, put under in another country. I don't know anything about these people. You know, what are the expectations? What boundaries can I set? What are my parameters? What rights do I have as a patient? Um, and am I gonna get my money's worth once, I, once I'm done? And I think these were real questions that a real patient ass, right, privately, and um, I'm not being, I'm not promoting here for you guys, this is me as a patient speaking honestly, and I, I want to make sure that everybody's clear about that, I want to be very transparent, there's no promotional benefit here for me, um, I'm speaking to a result that I realized from coming here, and um, I've been amazed at the professionalism, um, the logistics, how well you guys have handled the logistics, the facilities how do I say this without sounding um, like a commercial? It's impressive. Not only the cleanliness, but the level of, of, of experience that you guys bring your team. Your teams are, are real experienced people. Like the personnel, you can tell, they know their business. I think that's what impressed me the most. The level of professionalism I saw from each of the team members that interacted with me. I'm big on that. Uh, I'm a businessman. And so I need to deal with, at least in my business world, I want to deal with professionals that are going to compete with me or push me to be better. And um, in the service side, I expect great service. And I was really impressed with the level of service I received from all individuals. And how often can you say that about a company or an interaction with a service provider? You could say that, that, that everybody you dealt with uh, provided such a level of service, an impressive level of service. That's, that's unusual. Let's be very honest here. Um, you don't find that anywhere. Uh, but not, not, in my, not in my experience, customer service um, lacks in the world today, and I was real impressed with that. So that gave the first step forward to relax, 